Hello planner friends and welcome back to my channel. Today I have my February 2021 highlights video to share with you. For this month I did pull in a kit from Caress Press and yeah it's been a very long time since I've uploaded a monthly plan with me or a monthly highlights video. Um, I guess I should consider it highlights because I don't really use my monthly spreads functionally. I mostly just use them for memory keeping and just as like a strictly positive part of my planner, if that makes any sense. Because I know in a lot of my weekly spreads, like I'll put how I'm actually feeling. And if I'm feeling anxious, that's not necessarily super positive. But um, I want like my weekly spreads to be accurate. And then I save my highlights for these monthly spreads. So yeah, it's been, I think, like seven months since I uploaded my January <laughs> monthly highlights. It's definitely been quite a while. And I know when I tend to fall behind in posting my plan with me's, I also tend to prioritize the plan with me's because I feel like more people enjoyed those and more people watch the weekly spreads as opposed to the monthly plan or monthly highlights videos. So I tend to prioritize my weekly videos, but I was just feeling like I really wanted to put out a monthly and it's been way too long. So I guess I sort of jabbered through that whole first uh, section there. I didn't realize this at the time, but when I was filming, my camera had died by the time I got to Monday the 1st. So I did put down this Coffee Monday sticker from Hello Petite Paper along with one of the deco pieces from the kit. I just thought this kit was super cute and I loved all the cozy vibes, so I tried to incorporate as much of the deco as I could. Moving on to the second, I used this couple sticker from Kina Prince to mark that we received our wedding photo album. And my husband and I got married in 2017, so it's been... At, th at this point, it had been almost four years since we had gotten married, and we had approved our proofs for our wedding photo album, like, I want to say, like, in November of 2017, and it just, I think it just mistakenly never got ordered. So we ended up calling our photographer from our wedding, and she just sent it over to us, um, ordered it and sent it over to us. Cause I guess the order never went through for whatever reason. But anyway, we got that on the second. And then we also had Oh Sushi. That sushi sticker is from Magic Prince Co. On the third, I cooked some stir fry. So I used this cooking Maru from Paper and Milk to mark that. On the fourth, I'm pretty sure I either took a nap or slept in. So I just used this Sleep Girl from Kina Prince to mark that. On the 5th, there was a ton of snow, so I just wanted to use a wintertime emoji from the Coffee Monsters Code mark that, and then I also painted my nails. I will also say I remember very little of what actually happened back in February, so yeah, uh, there's not a whole lot of commentary I can add for most of this monthly highlights video. Anyway, on the 6th, I had an eye appointment. It had been quite a while since I had had my eyes checked, um, like to get glasses. So I was really excited about that. And I used this glasses emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. On the seventh, we got poke bowls for lunch. And I used this poke sticker from Papershire, I believe, to mark that. On the eighth, I spent some time cooking with my husband, which was a lot of fun. So I used another paper and milk Maru cooking to mark that. On the 9th, it was kind of a, well, it was probably a lazy evening, so I just pulled in this cat sticker that was, or that came with the kit. And then the YouTube binge, um, the YouTube icon is from Paper Shire. I just, I really loved how that pink sort of matched with the rest of the kit. It's super pretty. On the 10th, I had a super productive day. I don't remember what I was doing, but apparently I was real productive that day, so I just used this Go 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 Kina Prince girl. On the 11th, we got even more snow, so I just used this emoji in a pile of snow to mark that. On the 12th, it was Lunar New Year, so I pulled in a couple of Lunar New Year stickers that I have from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark that. I don't personally celebrate Lunar New Year, but I had these stickers in my collection and I just really wanted to pull them in. 
And then we also got Panera for dinner that evening. And that girl sticker is from Papershire, I think. On the 13th, again, we got Poke. So I pulled in another Poke Bowl sticker from Papershire to mark that. And then my husband and I just chilled in the evening and watched Skate the Infinity. I really enjoyed that show. I feel like I should probably rewatch it because I enjoyed it so much. But yeah, we were watching, I think, like the new episodes as they were coming out during this time. Moving on to the 14th, it was Valentine's Day. So I pulled in this Be Mine and Heart Balloon emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark Valentine's Day. And pretty much just spent the day hanging out with my husband. So I used this couple sticker from Kina Prince to mark time with Dave. On the 15th, apparently we had a snowstorm. So I pulled another one of these winter emojis from the Coffee Monsters Co. in to mark that. And we also had pizza that evening. I think we ended up getting pizza delivered like just before the snowstorm. So really I probably should have flipped those, but yeah. Oh, actually I do kind of remember that. It was really icy the next day. Yeah, I don't really have <laughs> anything else to say more than that. Moving on to the 16th, I spent some time reading, so I pulled in this book sticker from Paper and Milk. I love the little Maru as a bookmark. It's super cute. The 17th was Ash Wednesday, so I pulled in this heart icon from the kit. I didn't really have another sticker better to mark that, or to, to mark that differently or mark that better. I don't know. So I just pulled in that heart sticker for that. And then I did go to bed early that evening, and that bed sticker is from Papershire. On the 18th, apparently we got even more snow, so I just pulled in another emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark that. On the 19th, we got Slurpees from 7-Eleven. I love, I love me a good Slurpee, so that obviously had to go in my planner. And that girl sticker is from Stationary Heaven. On the 20th, I spent some time snuggling my kitty. So I pulled in this kitty sticker from Fox and Pip to mark snuggling Q. And then my husband and I watched Angels and Demons that evening. I think I liked it, but I can't say I remember a whole lot of it. So, wow, that, that's, a, that's a great movie review. I guess we're just going to leave that in. Moving on to the 21st. My husband made me brunch, so I pulled in a pancake sticker from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark that. And then I spent some time snuggling my Maisie Girl. The Shih Tzu sticker is from LME Creations. On the 22nd, I made myself some really tasty jasmine tea, and I pulled in this tea sticker or tea girl icon thing character sticker. That's what, I, that's the word I'm looking for. That is from Stationary Heaven. I just used that to mark the calming jasmine tea that I made myself. It looks a little bit like green tea in that cup, but, and technically I think jasmine is a white tea, but I don't know. It works well enough. On the 23rd, I spent some time snuggling my maple girl and that dog sticker is from LME Creations. On the 24th, I just spent some time planning, so I pulled in this planner sticker from the Coffee Monsters Co. That's been in my collection for a while. I actually don't know if she still sells those or not, but I just used that to mark some planning time. And then I pulled in one of the deco stickers from the kit because I thought it was cute. On the 25th, my husband and I had like a movie night in. This was, I think, before we both had gotten vaccinated. So we were spending a lot, a lot of time at home. <laughs> but yeah, we watched The Impossible, I think on Amazon or maybe on Netflix. But anyway, that couple emoji is from the Coffee Monsters Co. On the 26th, it was my husband's birthday. So I pulled in this balloon sticker that is from Magic Prince Co. And a like happy birthday, birthday party emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark his birthday. Oh, and then I also added one of the deco stickers. We didn't have macarons for his birthday, but I don't know. It, there was kind of like an awkward amount of space there, and I just wanted to add a little bit of extra cuteness. Moving on to the 27th, I just spent some time with my husband that day, and I always really enjoy when we get to have some time just, like, hanging out and 
especially on the weekends when we're not super stressed out. Um, that's always nice. And then on the 28th, we started binge watching WandaVision. Why does that feel like a throwback, even though the, this was only like nine months ago? <laughs> I don't know. It just feels like an eternity ago. So I don't know. But yeah, we were binge watching WandaVision on the 28th. And I think here I'm just adding a couple of extra deco pieces to fill up some of the awkward extra spaces that I had. And here I'm just putting my pages back into my planner. I did do a little viv wiggle, but there's not a whole lot of foil. This spread was kind of like back to basics for me. There's just a couple pieces of silver foil in there. And here is everything that I had left in the kit. Definitely got good use out of this one. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you are all taking good care and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.